Okay, this is kind of a weird one, I don't know, it's, it's a firmware issue more than likely, but I canceled the uh, print on the, the object on the left, because there was a lot more curling than I wanted down here in the corner. I mean, this one's got a little bit, but not bad, so. But if you watch, it'll print, so it prints still, does the normal printing on the right, but when it goes, yep, yeah, that, that's like it's going over to the left, uh, and it's like printing in midair, but it's not extruding, so it's, it canceled the object, but it still, looks like it's still doing the moves. So... Give it a second here. To, so it does all this over here. You can see it kind of like goes over to the left and does, doesn't do the full thing, which is weird. You know, it just adds a little extra time. But still a lot less time than if I'm just bringing both of them, so. Just a weird little thing. Alright, just to add a little more to this video. Uh, this is the one I canceled. This is the one I did not cancel. But if you look right there, this broke off at exactly the point that uh, it I canceled the other object at so there was it created a, a crack on the left side and then it just snapped right off um, so the adhesion was not good so that's probably a firmware issue that they're gonna have to fix uh, and in including the weird where it went over to the left side and pretended to print, but it didn't. <clears throat> so that, that's kind of weird. I'll have to. It may have been because of the particular part, but <clears throat> I'm gonna guess that it's uh, gonna happen again. So if you're thinking of canceling objects, yeah, you may want to consider otherwise until they fix it. Uh, or, you know, leave in the comments whether or not you've canceled objects and whether it's succeeded or not. It could have just been a fluke with this particular print. You know, maybe it's the number of items in the print. I don't know. Uh, there was another issue that I ran into that's not related to this, but uh, it's too short of an issue to actually do another video, so I'll just tack it onto this one. Uh, it was printing and I was about to run out of filament and I didn't have any more of that filament so I was going to went ahead and canceled uh, and I canceled it when it was doing the purge tower and the printer crashed and rebooted it did not like it at all so I believe I saw a pull request or an issue listed uh, on GitHub about that particular issue too. So, if it happens again, I'll see about doing a video. Either that or just don't cancel your print <clears throat> when it's doing the purge. Alright, that's pretty much it. Thanks. Bye. Okay, I'm still not quite done. I'm going to go ahead and add this to the video as well. I was printing this in this particular orientation and then I decided to print two of them in this orientation, one this way and one this way. And the print quality on the back turned out horrible for some reason. So that's something I'm going to have to investigate. <clears throat> um, I will be, my five tool upgrade will be here next week. And I'm going to upgrade that. I will then tune the belts and uh, we'll lubricate all of those things and we'll go ahead and try printing this again uh, to see <clears throat> you know if I get the same results or not it could just be a calibration issue um, 
not sure why you know maybe it didn't like that particular orientation for this angle apart but it's not a you know it's not it should this angle should not be difficult for this printer to handle but there are a couple variables that may have affected that I'll have to do some more testing so but I won't do that until after I upgrade my printer so that's it really this time this is it thanks